What's going on YouTube? This is your guy Garrett from King's Blood Gaming and I'm back with another video. So before I get into this, everyone, please keep an eye out for our beam team called the Broadband Bullies, which consists of myself, my pony homie Jesse P, and my boy NextGen720. We in these gaming streets wrecking these rival crews and shooters, fighters, sports games, whatever. I got whatever on us. Keep a lookout for us, and our Beam links are in the description below. Please check us out and follow us on Beam. So just about everybody in the gaming community expected some type of Halo 6 teaser or trailer being shown off at E3, but it appears that the Halo developer 343 Industries has shut that down. Community manager Brian Gerard confirmed on Reddit that Halo 6 will not be at E3 2017. He said there will be a little something at E3, but nothing related to Halo 6. <sighs> they asked if Halo 6 could be revealed at Gamescom, which is a couple months after E3, and Gerard said, definitely not. <laughs> Slight shot at Gamescom. Nothing major, a little bit, you know, slight, a little slight. <laughs> now, my take on this is to take this with a grain of salt, because quite frankly, they would want it to be a surprise when the trailer shows up at the end of the E3 show, just before the mic drops. I mean, think about it. <laughs> also, if this proves to be true, I'm happy. I have always said there should be one Halo per generation. And that Halo should blow everyone's mind with the story and the graphics. It should also have like continuous updates throughout its life cycle with things like maps, uh, weapons, if they want armor, etc. You know what I'm saying? But I also believe console life cycle should be five years. So, uh, I mean, this could be an opportunity to unveil something new, you know, a new IP. A new adventure or something. Something other than Halo, Gears, and Forza. Myself, I'm praying for Rise too, but with the situation between Microsoft and Crytek, that looks pretty far-fetched. What if Microsoft stopped forcing their studios to work on one IP and allowed 343 and the Coalition to work on something like, like one other IP, something else? I mean, that's not likely, but what if? <laughs> I mean, you know, my man Next Gen 720 is always, always asking people, you know, if we thought that, uh, like these, uh, these developers could do something else. And I think if any Microsoft Studio could do something else than what it's doing is the Coalition and 343. Ah, what if? But maybe, and just maybe. They push Halo 6 back a year to remove all that lock shit and give us the true Master Chief experience that we asked for. Maybe they had to change the story a little bit to remove that, you know, all that lock stuff and to give us fans what we want. We don't play Halo to be anyone other than Master Chief. Fuck out of here, lock. Let me know what you guys think about that, man. Sound off. Comment. Like, subscribe, King's Blood, out.